everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I wanted to share with you what is inside Pasaporte al Español, and I probably butchered that, but I am terrible at Spanish, so I'm gonna be learning right along with my kids. Now, this is an elementary Spanish kit from BJU Press, and I had this on my wish list this year. When I made my list of all the curriculum I wanted, this was on there, but we just didn't have it in the budget to go ahead and get the elementary Spanish kit. However, after I had made several videos talking about how much I love BJU Press Distance Learning, BJU contacted me and asked if I would like one subject kit for free. Um, it was not an exchange for a review or videos or anything. They just asked if I'd like one for free. And I said, absolutely, I want to give this Spanish one a try. So what I want to do in this video is open up this box and give you a peek at what actually comes in this kit. This is um, kit A and I'm gonna show you what's inside, what you get, and then later on in the year, I will give you a full review of what we thought of it after we've used it for a while. So let's go ahead and take a peek at what comes with this. All right, the box is open, and here is everything that you get in Kit A from the Elementary Spanish Curriculum from BJU Press. I've already pulled everything out and looked through it and um, unwrapped everything and then just stuck it back in here so that I could show you guys. So let's just go through each thing one at a time. The first thing that my kids saw and they were super excited about was this cute little guy. I believe he is a hedgehog and he goes along with the curriculum. And so he is actually a puppet so you can stick your hand right in there and make him move around such a cute little thing I had to go scrounge this guy up and look for him because my kids have been playing with him he has not been in this box he has been being well loved and another fun thing about him is he actually rolls up into a ball I believe that's what hedgehogs do right when they get scared they roll up into a ball that might be something that my kids and I have to go uh, check out for science is uh, facts about hedgehogs. But anyway, it comes with this cute little puppet. We'll tuck him right back in there. Another thing that you're going to get is this little booklet. And this is for you moms and dads. This is going to tell you exactly what comes in Kit A of Pasaporte al Español. And it's going to tell you what's in there and how to use it and just kind of give you some tips for getting things all set up. So that's really helpful. The next thing in here is the Listening and Songs CD. And this includes, let me show you, let me open it up and show you what comes in here. This is going to have CD, um, a listening CD for step one, a listening CD for step two, a listening CD for step three, and then a songs CD as well. And I believe the songs on here are ones that are covered in steps one through three. Now, um, kit A includes three steps or three levels in one kit, which is wonderful. Everything that is part of step one is gonna be in this yellow orangey color. So really easy to find what you need. If you're on step one, you look for everything that's this kind of yellow orangey color. Everything for step two is going to be pink and everything for step three is going to be blue. So that is really helpful the way they have set that up. Let me go ahead and show you inside here so you can kind of see what's gonna be on each CD. So for step one, as you can see, you're gonna have some read aloud books on that CD, some Bible verses, Bible truths, vocabulary charts, flip it over and look. You're also gonna have some teaching conversations and let's check it assessments. So lots of stuff on each CD for each step. And then over here, you can see for songs, you're just gonna be singing some wonderful songs with your kids. In Spanish, we've got Away in the Manger and Joy to the World and um, lots of things that you might be familiar with. Happy Birthday. So lots of fun things on that. So if you're like me and you don't know how to pronounce anything correctly in Spanish, this CD is going to be, this CD kit is going to be a great help, I know, to me and I'm sure it will be to you guys as well if you do not know Spanish very well either. So you do get that. Um, CD with four CDs in there, that CD case with all those CDs. 
All right, the next thing that you're going to get is this DVD of recorded lessons. Now this is only for step one. So like I said, in this kit comes three levels. Level one is called step one, level two is called step two, and level three is called step three. But there's only video lessons for step one. So I just wanna make that really clear. That was something that I was a little confused on. When I got kit A, I knew that it had three levels in it, um, but I was really confused about what the video lessons were of, and that is just to cor um, correlate with step one. Now in here, you are going to get um, DVDs with video lessons, and these are gonna have an instructor from uh, BJU Press and it's Jennifer Cox, so if you're familiar with her teaching in any of the other distance learning classes, you know who she is. And it looks like, you guys, it looks like there are 64, yep, 64 lessons on here. So that is a lot of lessons on uh, DVD on video. So my kids are really excited, I'm really excited to do these with them. So you do get um, video lessons for step one. All right, the next thing that you're going to do, you're going to get, not that you're going to do, but you're going to get, and you will eventually do with your kids, are read aloud books. And so for step one, you're going to get five different books. Step two, you're going to get five books. And in step three, you'll have six books to read with your kids. So here they are right here. So like I said, everything's color coded really nicely. So step one is this yellowy orange. The books for step two are in pink and step three are in blue. Let me go ahead and show you inside so you can see um, what the book kind of looks like inside. So you have it in Spanish and they are in color, which is really nice. So you're gonna get to have some great stories for your kids. I'll go ahead and show you one here from step two. See if I can open that up. So again, nice color pictures and they are in Spanish. So that's going to be really fun for my kids and I to be able to read some books in Spanish. So you get all of those 16 books. So that is great. The next thing that is in here are work texts and you will need one work text per student. So in the kit comes one set of work texts and then BJU Press sent me extra work texts for um, all of my kids that are going to be doing this with me this year. So here is just a kind of a peek inside step one. Just goes along with what they're learning, some activities and different things for them to do. And one of the things I'm really liking as I look through this is um, they are really tying um, Spanish um, and God's word and how one of the great reasons um, to learn another language is so that we can share the gospel with other people from other countries. And so there is just some great Bible truths. Um, they go through kind of what's called the catechism. Who is God? God is a spirit and does not have a body like man. And they having the kids learn that in Spanish. So really, really love um, that aspect of it as well. So that's a little peek inside step one. Here is a peek inside the step two workbook. Kind of flip through that. They say that this is geared, I believe, first through sixth grade. Now, I would say sixth grade, this is going to probably be a little babyish, but I'm having my sixth grader, actually my seventh grader, do it with us. Um, I would say first grade, um, it might be a little challenging. I don't know. I'm going to be doing this with a first, third, fifth, and seventh grader. So I will let you know um, later on in the year as I do kind of a full review, I'll let you know what each of those grades of my kids thought of this um, curriculum. But anyways, there's a look inside work text step three. All right, the next thing that you're going to get are some teaching charts here. And these teaching charts, they have vocabulary charts and they have song charts. They also have Bible verse charts and country charts. And again, everything is color co coded. So um, if it has a yellow in the corner, then you know that's for step one. Uh, step two and step three would be blue. They also, if you can see here, if this, this little bubble lets you know that that's a vocabulary chart. If you see um, the little songs there, uh, music notes, then that's gonna be a song chart. 
If you see the Bible, you know that's going to be a Bible chart. And then um, they have a map here that's for the country chart. So let me go ahead and show you kind of some samples of each. So here would be a Bible chart. First Juan uh, four eight. What is that? Uh, Cuatro ocho or something like that. I told you my Spanish is terrible. I'm going to be learning right along with my kids. So they have this little image to help kind of trigger the kid's mind for that Bible verse. And then they have it right here on the back in Spanish and in English. So that is really nice. So that is a sample of the Bible chart. Let's go ahead and pull one out for music. I'm gonna pull these over here so I don't get them all mixed up. Okay, so here's one for music um, and it has the song on the back. So that's really nice that that is right back there for you. Here is one of the um, ones for, what is that called? Country cards, one of the country charts. So this one's for Ecuador, some really pretty pictures for Ecuador, and then you also can see um, they have some information about that country. And then let's see, was there one more type of chart? Yes, there are the vocabulary charts. So here we go is a vocabulary chart, and then they've got all that information that you and your kids need on the back. So really, really helpful. Um, these are um, good quality. These are not flimsy paper. This is like thick cardstock with a gloss on it. So I think those will hold up pretty well. You could always laminate them if you wanted to to make them last longer, but I think these are going to hold up pretty well. And there's a lot of them, you guys. Look at all of these. I mean, that is just a ton. All right, move those over there. The last thing in here that I wanted to show you is the teacher's edition. And so this is really important so I know exactly what I am doing with this kit. And so it's got all the information that I need, again, color coded. So um, the yellow orange here, that's gonna be for step one, for step two, and for step three. And then it looks like they've got music in the back and um, you know little things that I can print out for the kids to do so lots of stuff in there to help me as I teach this again step one is on DVD so I'm not sure I'm, I'm going to need this right now for step one but I will definitely need it for step two and step three since that is not on DVD so that is everything that you get in this kit you guys I am really excited my kids are excited to give this a try and I will let you know what we think of it and how it is going the pros the cons and all of that so make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you will be notified of new videos in the future and you will know when that uh, review of this comes out in a few months. All right, you guys, I hope this was helpful for you. Uh, give it a thumbs up if it was, and I will see you guys in another video. Bye-bye.